gender violence, discriminations is still happening, not only in the Philippines, but yeah, all over the world, the world. Yeah, but then um, all our human rights are equal. So men, women, you know, um, human rights are, are equal. I am Juvi Angolchano from the Philippines, particularly in Mindanao. I am a human rights defender. I worked with Task Force Detainees of the Philippines. It is a human rights organization in the Philippines. And I do um, human rights documentations, particularly on like civil, political, economic, and sociocultural uh, rights, violence against women. It's uh, a huge issue. When, when we talk about like, uh, especially like in Mindanao, I worked with indigenous peoples community. Women are become vulnerable when it comes to climate issues because of what is happening now, like the climate change. And like the Philippines is um, prone to typhoons. We are experiencing floods and like women's and like uh, mothers have deep connections with the environment, especially like for, for the waters. The people use it for drinking, for washing, for cleaning, uh, usually like uh, in the household shores, women use it. It's, it's become more vulnerable and if uh, if we want to protect our women, we need to protect our environment. During uh, war, of course, there is uh, evacuations. Uh, the men concerns on like how they will uh, move or how, where they will go. But then the concerns of the women is yeah, for everything. Um, we will leave our house, our animals, what to feed on the chil for the children and also for the husbands. Actually, I have this hope as a mother, yeah, because I have a son. Yeah, I just hope that um, my son and with all the others in his generations, that their human rights will be respected.